it has been nearly a year guys exactly 10 months since my last upload on YouTube I'm gonna share with you where I have been what happened and everything that you asked me I'm gonna answer it in this video and of course I'm so damn happy to be back so let's do this of course guys this is the future and I don't know where to start I don't know where to begin but I've tried to film everything or every single day but it was not that easy guys and that's why you will see some days I was in a good place and other days I was in a bad place that's why I wasn't like committed or disciplined to film everything for you I've tried my best and now I'm back but of course I'm gonna try to share with you the most of it at the beginning I didn't took it really seriously because I thought it's gonna be easy it's gonna be like quick uh, it's not that bad and everything else I tried to stay positive of course but I was in some ups and some downs guys I'm honest with you I promise you it was not easy this period of time I dealt with a lot of injuries the worst of them all was my arm injury it was not easy for me to lose my arm for a long period of time and it was a little bit frustrated but I was I still managed to stay positive to stay motivated some days but other days I was really in a black hole I couldn't do nothing I couldn't work for a long period of time I couldn't go to the gym I couldn't do nothing beside like chilling on my couch and doing nothing and that and that was really hard for me as a person I'm not the type of guys as I told you to share bad vibes or bad energy I'm trying to give you the best from my situation so that if you also happen to deal with something like this you will be able to go out with it or to get the most of it stay positive do what you want to do because time pass and you will forget everything you will get better you will it, it is like everything in the world guys it has a beginning and it has an end and luckily for me the injury has an end my arm is now functioning like if I will say it's 90% healthy so I can now start doing the stuff that I love the most and that is sharing with you my journey and I hope you learn something from this video so enjoy peace day one guys I didn't manage to sleep well it was hard it was tough the pain was extreme and I couldn't manage to sleep for long hours so that's why I will I'm sure I'm gonna fall to sleep today at any time and if I'm not feeling pain but yeah it's gonna be a tough ride it's gonna be a tough six or eight weeks for me I will try to stay positive I will try to uh, make the most of it but we will see today is day one let's go day two guys I didn't sleep really well maybe I'm gonna take a nap in a few hours here you can see I just received this I don't know what the name of it but um, this is something that gonna help me put my arm in the right way if I wanna stand and walk because I don't wanna lay the, the whole time on the couch I just want to move a little bit to walk if it's only at home it's gonna be good but I will be outside of course also walking a little bit getting some steps it's not easy for me given the fact that I'm someone who's moving a lot who's doing a lot of sports fitness and basketball and everything that you can imagine to stay in shape or to stay fit actually at my age but now I can do nothing besides like walking at home or outside looking like this but yeah it is what it is day three or four guys I don't remember actually I really lost uh, traction of the time the feeling of days passing and time passing away 
as you can see my arm is hanging on my shoulder and I'm trying to motivate myself by watching some podcasts with the only one Mr. Beast and yeah um, trying also to move a little bit at home not only sitting around or laying on my couch as you can see this is my place right now this is my office for these days and I don't know how much or how long it's gonna take but the good thing is I can still move and I can appreciate the fact that I can still move on my feet I can still like uh, have a walk or get stuff for myself if I'm alone at home so it's it's really a good thing and of course as you can see I'm trying to be also a little bit productive that's why you can see my set now I'm editing my videos also here at the living room I can lay on my couch and I have my mouse and of course I can edit on my big screen here so I needed to be a little bit productive and as you can see here is my mouse I needed to improvise a little bit to have this mouse pad of course I have some pain pills and of course you can see some calcium 600 milligrams because as you know it's a fracture and my bones so I need a little bit more of calcium if I wanna heal my bone better than normal and yeah this is how I spend my day maybe tomorrow I will go to the barber make some changes stay tuned for it and yeah we will see how it's going to be and maybe i will go tomorrow to frankfurt so with my wife just to chill to have a nice day out of home and of course to be able to uh, walk a little bit and get some steps so see you tomorrow today is the day guys as you can see, I have a new haircut, feeling fresh a little bit. But today we have the appointment with the doctor to see if we gonna get rid of this thing or not. So we will see, maybe I will take it off today, maybe not. And if I take it off today, maybe the doctor will send me to do some x-rays to see if my elbow is doing well or if my arm is doing well. And from there, we will see how it's going to continue. It was a little bit tough this past days. Sleep was absolutely trash. But yeah, the day went actually normal, just chilling here at home, trying to be a little bit productive, some editing, some steps. But yeah, that was it. Of course, after we take off this thing, <laughs> uh, maybe we will do some physiotherapy, but we will see if it's gonna be today or if we are gonna stay a little bit longer like this. So now let's head to the doctor. And here I am guys, after the x-ray, waiting for the doctor to give me the news about my arm. So finger crossed. So, um, unfortunately, I didn't get some good news about my arm because it's still in a bad shape and I need to stay with a cast a little bit longer. This is not what I was expecting and it doesn't feel good right now. That's why I couldn't go home. I, I needed some fresh air and as you can see, guys, I was in, the, in a basketball field uh, just just throwing some shots and seeing other people having a good time. So yeah, life goes on. Let's see what tomorrow have in store for us. And after three weeks, guys, the day has come. Finally, I can see my arm, I can feel my arm, and, and it is a big deal for me. So this is awesome. So guys, we are getting this one away, so I don't need this one anymore, but I will get a new one that's gonna help me put it on my arm and take it off when I want. And yeah, that's big news. I'm so happy about it. And I will show you next how it's looking like. This will be the one that I will put 
instead of this one so that I can move my arm, straighten the arm, not rotate it. So this is gonna be the one for me today. And yeah, let's see how it works. But I'm so happy that I got this one off my arm. I didn't like it guys, it was horrible. Let's go. And here I am after getting home immediately I started moving my arm a little bit straight in it because I kept rotated as I told you before and this bracelet is perfect for just straightening my arm and giving of course a little bit of movement to it so next days was also awesome I've managed to get to the gym to hit some cardio I can also move freely at home i can cook i can do some laundry and also just the fact that my arm is now a little bit better than before gives me hope that i will be as soon as possible fit again to start my daily routine and of course guys this is really awesome just being at the gym and having a conversation with some friends feels also really good so yeah small changes but big impact.